Throughout the month of July, during our Living Local series, we've introduced you to attractions across the East. Today, WNCT's Dominique Moody heads south for a special look inside the Brock Mill House in Jones County. In Jones County, there's a historical structure tucked away in Trenton known as the Brock Mill House and Pond and serves as an opportunity for visitors to come and view one of the many attractions in the East. It's a history lesson you never see coming. We happen to be on an important route to the beach. At first glance, it may seem like the perfect place for a picture or postcard, but it's considered a hidden gem for the people in Jones County. It's very commonplace for many years. The original house was built in the 17th century, a key addition for farmers in the town. The farmers would arrive, they bring in the larger, the small amounts of the corn, and um, the miller would either grind specifically for him or he'd purchase his corn. The cornmeal production had multiple uses. For human consumption, it was for um, for livestock feed. So there was, you know, several different products that came from these mills. After years of cornmeal production, the Brock family created another way to serve the area. In 1960, the family would soon create the Brock Electric Company, which added an advanced piece of technology. A turbine generator that generated electricity for the town of Trenton. Powered the, uh, the courthouse, 10 street lights, five churches, seven businesses, and 28 residents. Insert the pond. Despite being built in the early 1700s with these same bricks and stones, this dam holds more than 122 acres of water on a day-to-day -day basis. Because they had added that electric motor that doesn't depend on the turbine, then um, we can turn that stone inside today and produce the same product that they did years ago. A key reason why Charlie Jones is preserving the legacy of his great great grandfather's dream. It's living history, making it more visible, more frequent. Um, it's important. It's also a great addition to the county's historical district. It's one of our focal points as far as tourism and recreation. It's on our county seal. Um, something we brandish for several years now. As a native county manager, Frankie Howard understands the importance of the Brock Mill House and Pond. Take ownership of it so we can preserve it for the folks that travel through and for the citizens. It's a beautiful place to stop, visit. Construction is set to begin on a new dock for kayaking and fishing later this year. Living local in Jones County, Dominique Moody, not on your side.